Today is the day that marks one of the craziest solo cash cups I probably ever played. The backstory is simple. It was my brother's bachelor's party. So I came back the morning of, and then I had a coach moneymaker the whole day. I made a video beforehand, and then I hopped on to play the solo cash cup. I hopped right into game number one. Now, typically, I usually don't have a landing spot when I play solos. It's not the greatest idea. And since I was pressed for time, I didn't care to come up with one. And with that said, in game number one, I went slappy shores. Game number two, I figured I'd be in a drone lobby, so I got the mythic charge at Eclipse the State. I haven't touched the game in about two days from this point, so do me a favor and just remember that. Bro, I thought I had a pump. It's gonna be, this is gonna be good. This is gonna be good. Now that I'm thinking about it, low key, I wanted to do that. That was actually a really smart move. Now I can come into this game and then I'll go crazy. In my third game, I knew by this time that I was 20 minutes deep. I'm definitely not gonna be in that great of lobbies. When I had that thought, I really believed I was a W here. What would I do? I'd say, I need to key this guy. By the time I got my third kill, it spiraled downhill fast. Within roughly 30 minutes of a two hour tournament, that is three games in the gutter. This is opens and you only have seven games. I wasted four of them. You might be thinking it can't get any worse. So in the fourth game, I decided to switch the landing spot up completely and I headed to the racetrack. Holy crap, bro. I am the bread merchant officially after this game. That was the easiest fight to clutch and I whiffed my shots. Um, all right. I am gonna, I'm just gonna end because I might go live afterwards. But, but for now, I will see you guys later. Okay, peace, peace. Okay, after four times of dying off spawn, I waited like 30 minutes. I should be in the most drone lobby known to man right now. About a qual in three games. Let's get this. After I survived off spawn, little did I know that there is soon to be a cheater in this game and I am not even trolling. Nice. 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 I just picked up two kills there. No, he's got to be cheating, bro.
No, this guy has to be cheating. No way, bro. That guy has to be cheating. Are you kidding me, bro? Homie had 17 kills. Knew he was in a drone lobby, but was camping on height the whole game. That's crazy. I can't get any more unlucky than this. I desperately needed those first place points too. Trust me, you are going to see. At this point, I'm thinking that I'm probably not going to qual. I have two games left. I barely had a warm up. And in game number six, I played so passive. It wasn't even funny. I camped all the way on top of the Bastion Mountain right here. But eventually we lived and I make my way into the zone. I'm versing drones. I feel like a drone. Oh my God, this is just awful. I hope this is worth it. The one thing about Fortnite tournaments is that you'll never truly know the exact number of points you need to qual. So obviously it can change by a few points. Last week qual was 62. So I knew that to be safe, I needed at least 65 at the lowest, but I'm aiming for like 70, which is very doable. And it could not have been any closer than this. Literally when I tell you every point matters. Bro, no way. Ladies and gentlemen, 63 points. I genuinely believe that I did not qual. And part of me was so mad that even if I did, I didn't even want to play the finals. Timer is running down and I found out I qualified by one point. The comeback was real. This time I had 50 minutes before finals started. So I hopped into my build fight zone wars map and I 1v1 to Owl and got smoked look at the scoreboard now i was definitely better than me but it's not usually like this that's how i knew i was off my game you need to see how these finals unfold it is comical the first game i pick up a kill i got pretty dang stacked i have a really good loadout now we head into game number one keep in mind every win is a hundred bucks 
Bro, homie, you gotta go as well, my dude. No, bro, I didn't see my head. Okay, so that was pretty unlucky. But in the second game, after all this hardship, there is still the light in me that is telling me that I can earn this week. I went to my drop, but it was scuffed. Fast forwarding to the end game, I go all the way to Sanguine Suites and I'm like one of the first people there. I was on the best side to rotate. But once I got in, there was a guy in a bush who needed a refresh. My god bro that's so annoying bro i land next to the guy with the heavy man a rocket so far up my ass unfortunately i boxed up next to probably one of two guys in the entire lobby with the heavy shotgun i'm not even messing with you to put the icing on the cake this is how the last game went I'm just so dead, bro. Bro, tell me how that just went down like that. Oh my god, I'm gonna fucking lose it, bro. Ken, what did we learn? Always warm up before a solo cash cup. 